maths class yes which lesson were they in sixth lesson multiples and factors yes in last few classes we have learned about what are multiples and factors multiples are answer of a number multiplied with different numbers i have told you multiples means like answer which comes in tables multiples of two means in two tables whatever answer comes two tens are also two hundreds are also is the multiple of two then factors means the number which you multiply to get the answer are called factors of that number for example 3 and 4 are factors of 12 okay now let us continue with the next concept that is finding the common factors of a given number okay i'll go with the textbook work only we were in exercise 6.2 Yes. Now, exercise 6.2, it is 7th main. Go to page number 132, children. The question is there. I will teach you along with the exercise sum and some more extra sums I will give you. Okay. So, we will work out the exercise also and I will be explaining you the concept also. Okay. Now, 7th main, just to see children, go to page 132 it says find the common factors of the following numbers yes find the common factors of the following numbers I have told you many times you have to read the question also. You should know how to read the question also. Many a times you don't understand maths because you don't understand the question. Otherwise you know how to do. Yes. Now first one. The question in textbook first one is 6 and 8. Yes. How to find the factors? You, I hope you remember how to find the factors. You write down 6. Factors of 6. How do you find factors of 6? You start with 1. 1, 6, the 6. Yes, in 2 tables, 6 comes as answer. Yes. 2, 3, the 6. Next, in 3 tables, does it come? Yes. But it is 3, 2, the. If it number is repeated, you stop. If number is repeated, you stop. You need not write that. Okay. Then, so, factors of 6 are here. Of 6. What are the factors of 6? 1. I told you you have to go this way. 1, 2, 3 and 6. Yes. Now, let us go to factors of 8. How do you find factors of 8? Same way. 1 is the 8. Obviously, 1 is there for all the numbers. Next, 2, 4 is the 8. 3 tables does 8 come as answer? No. 4 tables does it come? Yes, 4, 2 is the. But, we will not take because again 4, 2 is the means same numbers are repeated. So, right here now, factors of 8. What are the factors? 1, 2, 4 and 8. Now, how to find the common factors? What is common here? That you have to write. Now, here it is 1 and 2 only. So, you have to write therefore common factors of Common factors of 6 and 8 are. What are the common factors of 6 and 8? 1 and 2. That's it. So, finding factors however you know, write the factors of both the numbers, circle which are common and write the statement. Therefore, common factors of 
6 and 8 are. That's it. Okay. Yes. Let us move on to next sum. What is the next sum in the textbook? Just check children. What are the two numbers given there? Yes. The two numbers are 18 and 16. Yes. 18 and 16. Write down the numbers. Find the factors. Let us find out the factors of 18 first. 1, 2 is a. Sorry, 1, 18 is a. 18. Then, 2, 9 is a. 18. 3, anything is there? Yes. 3, 6 is a. 18. Then, 4 tables? No. 5 tables? 6 tables? 6 3s are will come. But can't because 3 6 are 6 3s are. So, no need. 2 times if it repeats, then you should not take. See, 6 3s are 3 6 are same numbers will come. So, stop. Then, for 16, 1 16 is 16. 2 tables? 2 8s are 16. 3 tables? 3 fives are 15. No. 4 tables? 4. 4 is a 16. 5 tables it will not come. 6 tables it will not come. Because 6 ones are 6. 6 twos are 5. 7 tables? 7 ones are 7. 7 twos are 14. 8 ones are 8 ones are 8. 8 twos are 16. 8 twos are and 2 eights are. It is repeated. So, come. Okay, next. What is the next step? Write down. Factors of 18 are. What are the factors of 18? List out the factors of 18. 1. As I told you, don't write any number any time. It is, you will forget some numbers. So, you follow a method. 1, 2, 3, 6, 9, 18. Ascending order like this. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 18. Follow this method children. You will never forget any number. Okay, then. Factors of 16 are. What are the factors of 16? 1, 2, 4, 8. When it is repeated 2 times, you have to write only one still. Okay? 8 and 16. Now just check which are the common factors of 18 and 16. Can you just check and tell me? Yes? 1 and 2. Is there any other number common? No. So, that's it. You can write the code. Common factors of 18 and 16 are 1 and 2. So, this is how you find common factors of any two or maybe three numbers also you can do. Here I am teaching you only common factors for two numbers. Okay. Now, some extra sums I would like to give. You can take down. Next sum, you can take down. It is 20 and 24. 20 and 24. Let us do this now. Yes. 20. Yes. Write down the factors for 20. 1. 20 is a 20. 2. Yes. 2 tens are 20. 3 tables. Will you get 20? 
3 6 is 18. 3 7 is 21. 20 is not there. So, 4. In 4 tables, will you get 20? 4 5 is 4 5 is 20. In 5 tables, will you get 20? 5 4 is So, stop. Don't write. 6. 24 tables we will see. 24 factors of 24 we will see now. One twenty four is twenty four. Two twelve are three. How much? Three eight are four. Yes, four six are five tables. It will not come. Six tables six four are again. It is repeated, so don't write. Okay. Now list out the factors of these two numbers. Right now, factors of twenty are. Write down one. How do you write? Start from this side. Two, four, five, ten. And 20. Next. Factors of 24 are. Tell me what are the factors of 24. List out. 1, 2, 3, 4. Then 6, 8, 12 and 20. Four. These are the factors of both the numbers. Now, how do you find the common factors? Yes. Circle the numbers which are seen in both the factors. 1, 2, 4. Any more? No. That's it. So, write down. They four. Common Factors of twenty and twenty four are which are the common factors? Write down, children. One, two, and four. So these are the common factors of twenty and twenty four. So I have done three sums for you. And there are two sums, extra sums. Actually, this one also was extra. Another two sums I want you to do the same way. Very easy, children. So, you just take down the questions. Solve it on your own in any rough book. Evening, you can check with my answer which I sent. Then you can copy it in the classroom. Is it okay? Yes. Take down the questions. D. It is 12 and 21. Next, E. It is 14 and 28. These two sums, you have to do it in the same way. Find the factors first. Then list out the factors. Then circle the common factors and last you have to write the four common factors of and complete the sentence. Okay. Yes. Here we have completed the concept of common factors. Yes. You do these two sums and we will meet in the next class with another concept of divisibility rules. Okay. Yes. Okay children. Thank you.